therefore you should be extra cautious before buying any spiritual items to boost your luck, to boost your health whatsoever and always verify the source that you're buying from. So personal story, in 2018, I met this new friend who was a business owner and I always saw on his Facebook postings regarding this item that he was selling and how people were winning 4D, were striking business deals successfully whatsoever after buying this. So at that point, I got a bit greedy and asked him out to check out more about this item and I wanted to buy from him also. When we met, he told me that the two, the red ball and the black ball, they were actually called centipede pearls and they would actually help to bring luck and fortune to a person and help to protect against evil spirit. So for that bronze looking thing you see inside there, it's supposedly some sutra scriptures. He actually took up the balls and let me feel it at, the, at my palms and my fingertips. He told me to touch it and he told me to feel whether there was any vibration and any energy like movements. And indeed there was. It's like a very strong and fast vibration when you hold, you hold the two sensitive poles. Very impressionable then. I saw his testimonials. He looked like a trustworthy guy. I felt it and so I bought it from him. 800 bucks, I still remember. Just me throughout 2018, I had bouts of temperament where I would just get super angry all of a sudden over very minor things. Like for example, someone being late for a meeting, someone not doing something. And I could observe myself being angry and I know that I shouldn't be angry. However, I just couldn't overcome the anger. In the part of the year, by chance encounter, I let my spiritual master have a look at this item and tell me whether was it good for me or not. Here's what she told me. In this item, there was a baby spirit and the negative energy from the baby spirit was basically influencing me and affecting my train of thought and hence my moodiness. She told me how to get rid of it and after I got rid of it, my mood really stabilized throughout the whole of the year and from then on out, I really became angry ever again and I became generally a very calm and peaceful. That's why I feel that the understanding of energy is items, especially spiritual items, contain certain energies and if it's bad energies, it can really meddle with our train of thoughts and our whole entire emotional and mental state. Energies are very potent, possessive entity. So for example, people who are under the influence of negative energies, some of them manifest itself as depression and that's why people with depression generally aren't able to control their sadness. They just keep feeling sad no matter how many good things people tell them and how many good things happen to them. What needs to be understood about this topic, meanwhile, Single spiritual items before you.